this kid, Ollie Schneider Jans, is tough to miss. He's the one without a hat. I'll wear it when I'm not playing, backwards or forwards, when I'm not playing, but on the course, I don't like to see the bill. And a solid head of hair to show for it, which always seems unfazed, even when he's swinging the club head over 120 miles per hour. I kind of like having that be my thing. The name is catchy, too. Ollie Snyder Jans. But more fun to say than spell. S-C-H-N-E-G-J. I think it's Schneider, J-A-N-S. S-C-H-N-I-E-D-E-R-J-A-N-S. The three-time All-American, currently full-time on the Web.com tour, is more certain of his own game. I try to just be a good balanced player, make a lot of eagles. A great eagle pot. Schneider Jans is the latest prodigy from the class of 2011, though he took a different route than most of his fellow classmates, even after ascending to number one in the world amateur golf rankings. After five wins his junior year at Georgia Tech, he stuck it out for his senior year. I just wanted to finish what I started, and I set out to go for four years no matter what. It's tempting because you see how great these guys are doing, what kind of tournaments they're getting to play in, and you think you belong out there too. Schneider Jans proved he belonged in 2015 when he became the third player since 1960 to make the cut as an amateur at both the U.S. Open and Open Championship, behind only Tiger Woods and Phil Mickelson. It was back across the pond the very next week to turn pro at the RBC Canadian Open, where he continued to impress. Ollie Schneider Jans just birdied the last three holes. With a top 25 and a T15 a week later at the Quicken Loans National. I had some Sundays where I was right in the mix, but if you're playing for your card, you know, it becomes such a big deal. You got to be cool and calm collected on Sundays because it can get emotional if you let it. You expect big things from him. Still working to secure his PGA Tour card, Schneider Jans has seen success on the Web.com Tour, posting multiple top 10 finishes. I've learned a lot just being out here. Have a good perspective, uh, long-term focus. Some of the guys that have gotten out here quick, we know we got a, hopefully a long career. My goal is to win one, and then that knocks it out at this point. I have a full schedule on the web now and off to a good start, so I'll be trying to get in that top 25. But you have to be patient, and you have to have that long-term focus and perspective.